and welcome to LT Outdoors, the channel with everything the outdoor world has to offer. Gotta be an 11. Wow, I've never seen one that big. <laughs> Sun is coming up, Bob is going down. Look at that. Fish are all about and jumping all around. Let's hook up the boat, come on, let's go, it's time for LT Outdoors, I'm talking. LT Outdoors, might go hunting, fishing, metal detecting, might even do a little fortune too, I'm talking. LT Outdoors, I hope you enjoy the show. Get a load of that. Well, hello everybody. Welcome to another episode of LT Outdoors. In this episode, doing something a little bit different. It's something I enjoy doing every year. I think you guys enjoy when I do it. I am out trout fishing on the ice. I am trying to get into some steelhead today. Something that, I'll tell you what, if you have never caught a steelhead through the ice, highly, highly recommend it. There is nothing in the state of Michigan that fights like that. Nothing at all. Uh, for those of you that have caught them in the summer or spring or fall on a rod, you know what I'm talking about. Nothing peels line like that. Um, it's just ridiculous. And they are a blast on an ice rod. So I had a lot of fun today. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this episode. Let me know what you think and hit that subscribe button. That's Hope this is that steelhead that just came through. Nope, it's a pike. Not what I'm after, but I'll take it. It's a fish. Looks like it might be a keeper too, so they're good eating. He is not wanting to give up. <sighs> nice. It's a pretty pike. Look right in the corner of the mouth. This is on uh, one of my pike harnesses that I tie up, guys. I've showed these before. I even did a video on how I tie them. Um, but I sell these, so anybody interested, they're two bucks a piece. Just email me. Well, he's only 23 inches, guys, so he's going back down the hole. <laughs> oh, this is a little pipe. Came right out of the hole. Yep, this ain't the one that I just had. That's a little bitty pipe. Wasn't fast enough to get this on camera, guys. This is a big steelhead. Big steelhead. He's a pretty one, too. Oh, he's right under me. 
right underneath of me. I don't know if you could see that. It's crazy in this clear ice. Look at that fish. Oh. This thing had a lot of bright colors. Whew. Hardest part guys is getting them to go in the hole. They don't like to put their head up. See, the hardest part, guys, about this clear ice is if that fish sees me, he starts going crazy. And he sees me every time I see him. Four pound test, guys. Well, this is where you do a lot of praying. the hardest part guys especially these big ones
It's a big male. that ice, they really hate it. I'll tell you this inline has better drag than I than I thought man I was really worried I was worried about this drag but it's not bad Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Oh, my gosh. Get, get a load of this. Oh, that is a steelhead. Look at that. Little pink tungsten right in the corner of his lip. And that hook, it's a good hook. He was hooked good. That was not coming out. Look at that. Had the double red on there. Get a load of that. Look how pretty that is. I wish I was quick enough to have gotten that on camera because when that thing came in, it looked so pretty. It did not hesitate. I'm gonna show this real quick. It did not hesitate to hit this little tiny, I can't get it to focus, but it's a pink tungsten with little tiger stripes and just this r little red double tailed plastic. That's it. That is it. He came flying in. Bam. Nailed it. And there we go. Hope you guys enjoyed that. That fight was insane. <laughs> Cromer. Beautiful Cromer. This is a young one, man. He is pretty. God, he flew in for this too. Man, I can't believe how pretty that is through the ice. Got it. <laughs> oh, yeah, baby. Oh, my God. I got to get a picture of this, dude. This is a... Uh... Oh, that was on a three mil. That was a three I had down. Yeah. Yep. Three mil chrome. Um, looks like the fireball. God, what a pretty fish. <laughs> All right, guys, get a load of that. What a beautiful, beautiful chrome fish right there. That is gonna be delicious. Nice young, nice young fish. And ah, I tell you, that was on a three millimeter. Three millimeter, which is dinky. Look at this. Three millimeter, it's hard to zoom in, tungsten with a little plastic split tail white RBM lures baby oh 
that's a perfectly cooked trout right there folks that's what I'm talking about right there folks that was that smaller steelhead that was a 16 incher that is a good eating size right there let me tell you what nice pink beautiful pink meat It is hard to beat that, folks. That is a good trout. Got to eat the skin, too. Mm. Another good reason to target steelhead through the ice. They are delicious. I hope you guys enjoy this. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. LT Outdoors has been brought to you by RBM Jigs and Lake Effect Lure Co. Everything for the serious ice fisherman. Sportsman's Connection. Mapping the outdoors since 1992. Wellman's Bait and Tackle. Check them out in Oscoda, Michigan. Cowboy Coffee Chew. A cup and a pinch. Crooked Bend. The leader for food plot mixes here in Michigan. And Bass Brother Lures and Baits on Facebook. Excellent trapping lures and baits. And Shelly's Shirt Shack where all the LT Outdoors merchandise is made. <laughs>